Have you ever wondered how the internet, the thing you use every single day, actually started? Because it wasn't invented by Google, or even by the people who built the first computers. The internet began as a military communication tool, created out of fear. It's the 1960s. The United States and the Soviet Union are deep in the Cold War. The US government worries that if a nuclear attack hits, traditional communication lines could be destroyed. So scientists come up with a radical idea. What if computers across the country could stay connected, even if parts of the system were knocked out? This idea turns into ARPANET, a network funded by the US Defense Department. Instead of sending information in one big stream, it's broken into small digital packets that can find different paths to the destination. This concept becomes the foundation of the modern internet. 1969, two computers, one at UCLA, one at Stanford, attempt the world's first internet message. The plan was to type the word login. They got as far as LO. The system crashed. So yes, the first internet message was literally LO, like it was trying to say hello. Through the 1970s and 80s, more universities and research labs join. This is where the word internet appears, short for interconnected networks. New rules or protocols called TCP IP standardize how computers share data. On January 1, 1983, these rules go live. Many people call it the birthday of the modern internet. But the internet still wasn't easy to use. That changed in 1991 when a British scientist, Tim Berners-Lee, invented the World Wide Web. Websites. Links. Browsers. You no longer needed to be a computer expert. You could just click. In 1993, the first popular browser, Mosaic, launches. Suddenly, regular people can search, read articles, and share information. By the late 90s and early 2000s, everything explodes. Google, Wikipedia, online shopping, then social media, smartphone apps, and streaming video. What started as a secret military experiment becomes the biggest communication system in human history. Today, over 5 billion people are online. We learn, work, date, play, buy, and communicate through screens. And it all began with fear. A crash. And the word, L.O.